Alright, so what's poppin' God Squad? Today is the day that I'm going to destroy Raid Trunks and everybody in that mission. There's a particular reason why, okay? Now, I did ask you guys in the last video, yo, what team should I run to beat this mission? And you guys were giving me some ideas, but there was one in particular that stood out from the rest. I think only a few of you guys told me, like a, not even a handful, less than that. But a few of you guys told me of a particular team that can help me out with that. That's what I'm about to try to um, run right now. So let's hop into that mission, though. Today, I'm going to attempt to run the Chao Tzu team. Now, if you guys don't know, this team is literally the pinnacle of God. I kid you not. If you run everything properly and you manage to get everything perfect, like in battle, as far as the gauge goes, you're practically never going to need another team ever again. But I know there's one flaw that I have with this team in particular, but I'll, I'll get to that in a second. Anyways, let me show you guys the cards that I have because th this team is freaking crazy. So, all in all, you see the characters that you need, but the cards that you need is um, this Chao Tzu. You're going to need uh, this Master Shen. You don't necessarily need this Supreme Kai of Time. The only reason why I have her is because of her ability, and there are other characters who have this exact same ability. I know um, one Kid Goku GT card has this exact same ability, but I don't have it. So that's the only reason why I'm running Supreme Kai of Time. So if you see this ability, you can use any character with it because it'll help out for a particular reason, which I'll explain during battle. Then of course you need this hit card. And for fifth, you can choose anybody. I'm choosing Vegito Blue because of the fact of um, his abilities when he gets, or when he beats out the opponent. That plus final Kamehameha, uh, Kamehameha is just super powerful. but. Uh, that's not the only thing I need to show you guys. Now, if I go over here and I scroll down to, I believe, the SR pluses. And if I can get to that particular ring, which shouldn't be too far. Oh, well, I scrolled way too far down, I think. But uh, let's see. Let's see. It's right here. Okay. This ring right here. I equipped it on Vegito Blue hits and most importantly on Chao Tzu. Chao Tzu definitely needs it. But this ring has two solid abilities one if i'm not mistaken it raises your attack by ten thousand by ten freaking thousand that's a lot of damage not only that it adds a perk where you can't be stunned at all like you know like if you look at your willpower and there's that green border around it you can't be stunned so we can take damage and nobody's getting knocked down so they can't attack that is oh this this ring is so good but there's another ring that needs to be on Master Shen in particular. And I believe that's just a regular SR ring, which is really far down too. Uh, I think I just passed it. I think I just passed it right here. Okay, this ring, I don't know what it does specifically, but I do know that it does aid um, Chao Tzu in particular with his attack, if I'm not mistaken. Again, I don't really understand Japanese like that, but this is essential towards um, Chao Tzu dealing some mad damage and again if i don't slip up then you guys will be able to see everything in action but that's pretty much everything that you will need i wish i can go more in depth and if you guys do want me to go more in depth then i'll probably make like a dedicated video for those of you who do have ultimate mission x like i said if you get everything off properly you're really not going to need another team and on top of that i mean you guys have been begging me to use a different team so i hope you guys are finally happy <laughs> but um the last piece of the puzzle now, this is where I said I don't really have this team fully complete. You need specific hero badges that activate in round one that lowers your opponent's defense. Now, even without it, you still deal a lot of damage, but this just makes the battle just so much easier, if you will. Now, with this one in particular, this lowers my opponent's defense by 45%, but it activates in round three. So if it gets that far, then I should be able to blow them back. But of course, by round three, they're going to have a crap ton of willpower and we might not, uh, might not even be able to fight back. But I mean, it's still worth a shot. But um, you're supposed to aim for a hero badge. I believe it's the Arale hero badge that lowers their defense by 30%, but in the process, it activates in round one. It makes this like 10 times easier. So yeah, if, I, if you guys know where to find that Arale hero badge, let me know because I can't find it at all i just can't now again if everything goes smooth i should be able to beat this in round one 
If not that, then chances are the battle's gonna go downhill. And through there, I'm probably just gonna like try to finish out the match and run it back. Because again, if everything goes well, then this is child's play. If I mess up in round one, then it's pr pretty much gonna go downhill. It's it's high risk, high reward. Okay, round one. Okay, as soon as we skip all this, I can show you guys how to set it up. So, what you're going to do is you're going to take Chao Tzu, hit, and your fifth, and put them all up. Take Master Shen, put him behind Chao Tzu, and Supreme Kai of Time, put her behind hit. Now, the reason being is because Master Shen raises his student's attacks by um, three. So, that's three times the damage for his students. That's Chao Tzu and Tien. But on top of that, if Chao Tzu attacks, he raises his own attack by 1.2. So that's, that helps out a lot. They're pretty much multiplying the multiplier. And then Supreme Kai of Time, her ability is um, she activates um, uh, any card's ability, regardless of how much willpower or key that you have. So that helps out a lot. Okay, we got them all locked on. We should be good to go. If I don't mess up with Vegito Blue, that helps out so much because I get to knock out their key. I need that. Like, I need their key gone. But if anything, I really don't want to mess up with Chao Tzu. Like, Chao Tzu is the one I really want to make it with. Alright, no mistakes. Darn it! You can't be serious. Alright, if you can mess up like that with Chao Tzu, that'd be freaking awesome. See, 1.2. Oh, this is going to be nice if I don't mess up. Nice and perfect. Okay. So, again, I'm missing the proper hero. Oh, my God. I take everything back. Kill him. Gone. Gone. Look at that. One shot. One. Oh, and I messed up with Vegito Blue and eradicated them. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I utterly decimated them. And I even got a freaking solid batch from it. What? Oh, my. Uh, oh, this is one that uh, lowers their defense by... Wait, by 50? Oh, no, it's not their defense. It's uh, something else. But, I mean, heck, I'll take it. What? Why would I not? Oh, that's final round. What, what can I get rid of? Uh, I, I don't know what to get rid of. I'll probably get rid of this. I don't really have a reason to have it if I have, like, the ultimate one. So, yeah. Bye. But I know y'all saw that damage, bruh. Oh. My. <laughs> We're out here slaying people. Woo! We are out here slaying people. Oh, but I, if I get a freaking platinum coin off that, I'm going to be so happy, bruh. I'm trying to tell you. And it, it didn't even take me that long to get this team because most of the characters you... Oh, I didn't even get a platinum coin. Man, I, I'm too happy. I, I don't even care. But, um, again, it's just... It didn't even take me that long to get these characters. Really, because most of them you get along the way. And I believe Chaozu you find on the map? Yeah, Chaozu's on the map. Master Shen is in one of the tournament stages. You get Supreme Kai of Time through playing the story. What else? Hits is in a secret area. I, I have I have to figure out which one it is. And who's the other character? <laughs> uh, I already said Hit, Master Shen, Supreme Kai of Time. Oh, the fifth is Vegito Blue, which you get him from um, these missions. So, hmm. Like, I, I don't know if you really do get a card from this. Let me try that again. Like, I want to run it back just because, I mean, again, this time I could mess up and just the battle could drag on. But even so, it's just... It's insane how much damage he deals. And if I, let's say I hit it with Vegito Blue, but I mess up with Chao Tzu, that's still going to deal some solid damage because if I'm not mistaken, even while they guard, he's dealing damage. So I, I could definitely like go for that and then try to like do something in round two, even without key. I should be fine. So, whoo, that, that was freaking awesome. I, I want to see that again. If I don't mess up again, I'm gonna be so happy. That plus, I'm aiming for Rage Trunks, so I want something from this mission. Either a Platinum Coin or a Trunks Supercard. 
I mean, I already have all the Goku Black cards. I already have the Zamasu card. I already have the Vegito Blue card. I just need that Trunks card, the, the one that's chilling right there. I need it. I am him. He is me. Oh, and another thing I forgot to tell you guys is I was um, just flying around the story trying to find Chao Tzu. Once I did, I flew to the top right of the stage like you guys have been telling me. Because there's times where it, like enemies have approached and there's times where enemies haven't approached. But in this particular case, an enemy did approach and it was Golden Frieza. So I did manage to recruit Golden Frieza onto my team so I can't use him in story mode now. Which is freaking awesome. Although that makes me wonder if I can go to arcade mode. Well, no, because my um my um items don't um transfer over there. Crap, I just realized that. Whatever. I mean, even without the items, it should still deal solid damage without it. So, still, I want to be able to get uh, angered Golden Frieza because you guys have been telling me for the longest time, get angered Golden Frieza. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay, it's not that easy. All right, let's aim back for Rage Trunks again. Okay. All locked on. Nice. And we're going first again. Woo! Please, if I don't mess up, oh, that'd be a godsend. Like, I just want to get perfect everything, just like spreadsheets. All right, let's do this. It's time. No mistakes. Wow, that was a gigantic mistake. Holy crap. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, not perfect, but lives should be ending. End his life. End it now. Gone. Gone. Wait, you, you got, oh my God. I know you guys see that damage. I know y'all see that damn. Okay. <laughs> like I'm so happy. Like Jesus Christ. Like you guys have no idea how hard I've struggled against this battle, bruh. Cause this battle's been out for a while, and I've been out here struggling. All right, let's get. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, hello. Uh, no, I might actually keep this. Wait a minute. Is this the same ability? It is, and it's a first round ability. Oh crap! It's not a lot, but it's a first round ability. I, ooh, and by ten percent, and even with how much Chao Tzu already deals by himself, holy crap! Okay. Oh, what can I get rid of? Let's see. Uh, that's level seven and level two. These these are final round badges, and most of my battles never go that long. I think. I'll I'll get rid of this actually. I'm surprised I'm getting rid of like an ultra rare badge. For like just a regular freaking badge. But I mean it has first round abilities. Like that would help out significantly. And I kinda wanna try it out too. And even at that, again, like if this helps me like get closer towards getting a platinum oh, sure enough. Platinum coin game. All right, let's try this out one more time. I do want to try out that badge because now I have a badge that gives me that um that foothold, if you will. First round defense down? Yes, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah, just making sure I'm not tripping. Yeah, first round defense down by 10. I will take that. Thank you. Okay. Ooh, that's the last of my um EXP too. You know what? I'm out here getting like super hyped, but again, I could still mess up and just ruin everything. <laughs> That's the thing. I. Ugh. From the heavens comes the team. Like, I really wonder how much this fares, too. Okay, so first and foremost, we power up. And then we have our overall boost. Round one, hero bat should activate now. It's not a lot, but it's defense down by 10. I'll I'll take it. That's still defense down. And with our attack being freaking skyrocketing right now, I mean I don't really think we have much to worry about. Alright, one last time. Could you imagine if I don't mess up three times in a row? That'd be freaking awesome. 
Okay. Right, let's go get him. So that's one, that's two, and that's three. Here, Rage Trunks. Wait, when are they going to like truthfully put him in the game, like where he's obtainable? Because I want him on my team. Okay, again, no mistakes, right, guys? <laughs> oh, wow, um, that's another mistake. Wow, that was damn okay. Miracle perfect. It came through. All right, Chiaotzu, end it all. I don't know if the times 10, um, or not times 10, minus 10 really did much. I mean, I did like 80k the first time I ran that. But again, it's a weak hero badge, so I didn't really expect it to do too much. If it was 30% down defense, then yes, they would utterly get destroyed even if they blocked. But still, not too bad. I mean, I'm just happy I have a round one hero badge. If I can get a... Okay. <laughs> that shut me up real quick. Oh, but these are final rounds. Okay. Uh... I mean, I've never seen this one before. I'll, I'll take it. Just what could it replace? Because this is round three. This is just something entirely different. And that's final round as well. Uh, hmm. I don't know. I, I, I just want to have it, honestly, just to have it. Tell you the truth. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to deal with, like, hero badges that's, like, final round and crap. Because it, it takes too long. Well, okay. No, granted, I already have I already have a hero badge like that. So, I mean, I, I don't really mind getting rid of it. I can always get another one. Especially if I can just farm this mission. Like, I, I have no complaints. Now, the real question is, what else could I test this out on? Like, if I can just utterly destroy people now. Oh, oh, it's time. Give me that platinum coin. Okay, so it's clear as day that we can't get any characters from this mission, but we beat it three times in a row. Three. They didn't even have an opportunity to attack. Not once. All right, what I can do, I guess, for now is I'll hop on to the Gashapon machi uh, machine, try to get some cards, and then from there, um, I'll go into arcade mode and see what I can make work in there. Um, hopefully uh, something good can happen. Guys, we're Dokoning it right now, okay? We're gonna get some, some some solid cards, you know what I'm saying? Yes. Uh, ooh, I forgot, I did unlock like a lot of the God missions. But back to God mission seven. <clears throat> well, I have, uh, I didn't even realize how many coins. I have nine blue coins, three bronze coins, and two platinum coins, woo! So, what? I could do four singles and a multi for the blue coins. Okay. Ooh. Is the card strong? Most definitely not. But that looks freaking cool. Okay. Like, Beerus and Shampoo in the background? I'll, I'll, I'll take it. It looks awesome. Not really an L. All right. So, I'll do three more singles and then a multi. And then give her the bronze coins and then the platinum coins. Wow. A Raditz card. Fantastic. Okay. No. Uh, should I keep doing... Well, I still haven't gotten that um, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta card. That's why I'm still going for it, I guess. Okay, we got a Zarbon card. You know what? I'm going to um, do the multi on God Mission 8. Why not? Because God Mission 8 has some, like, viable freaking cards. Okay, let's back out. Oh, I backed out too far. Uh, God Mission 8. And do the multi here. Because for all you know, we could get a solid, like, clean card from this. Oh, crap! Woo! You know, when I say I'm God, I mean it. <laughs> oh, crap. It's ironic how, for the past few videos, I've been doing God Mission 7 
because if I'm not mistaken, the um the Vegeta blue card is in there, and I never got it. And then I go to God Mission 8, it's not the same card, or not the specific card, but sure enough, it's a Super Saiyan blue Vegeta card. Okay, I, hmm. <laughs> I don't even know how to feel. All right, uh, let me back out, go to the bronze coins now. Uh, what other missions do I have unlocked? Not that many? Okay, so back to God Mission 8. I'm gonna stick here. I'm like, <laughs> they, these guys came through with the fire. Okay. Um, I don't, re I don't understand why I don't remember his name because like Tapion is like one of my favorite characters. Um, his little brother though, I, I don't remember his name, but it's, it's a cool card nonetheless. Uh, we got a Gotang card that can turn to Gotangs. Not really that impressive. And we have the Megeta card again. Freaking yikes. Okay. Now, last, the Platinum Coins. The rare coins that took me forever to grind for, all right? We're going to spend them. Platinum. Hopefully it doesn't give me despair, man. Give me something solid. I mean, um, we got Miss Majestic. I mean, look at that hair, bro. Nice and flowing in the air. Y'all know what I mean. Okay. Last coin. Give me something solid. Come on now. These are platinum coins. They're not easy to get. And we got another Goku card. Okay, that's all my coins. <laughs> all my coins, we didn't really get um, good coins per se. Except for um, that Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta card, which was great. But all in all, we didn't really get good coins. But eh, whatever. I think now, uh, yeah, arcade mode. Oh crap, you know, I just realized I have to try it. Actually, not even try. I have to pick that team. Oh, that, that's gonna take a while. Uh, let's see. Where's one mission that I know I need to complete? Oh, this mission, cause, um, Anchor Golden. But I don't, I don't think it's gonna, um, I don't know, man. Okay, this is Anchor Golden Frieza. Difficulty's ridiculous, but crap, I have to go find my team. I have to remember um like which cards were um which I, I believe let's see, hit was Berserker, uh Supreme Kai of Time was um uh, crap, I, I I don't even remember off the top of my head. I screw it. I mean I'm pretty sure I'll find them along the way. Again, in this since it's arcade mode, I can't use like any items. I can use like uh, hero badges and um, capsules and whatnot, but I can't like use like items, you know, like rings, earrings, and um, belts. So that's going to make things difficult. But I mean, all in all, if I can still set up the team, everything should work out for the best. Now it's just about setting up my team properly because I have to, uh, let's see, I have to find hit first. Uh, which might take a while. Which I don't understand why. Like, it really shouldn't take that long to find Hit. Where are you, Hit? Where are you at? Specify. Um, Berserker. Okay. Move to the left. Okay. I should find Hit uh, much quicker this way. Let's see. Hit, I know you're here. And before I passed Hit already, too. I'm. Uh, oh, he's right here. Okay, so there's hits. We'll see. I need Master Shen. I know he's an elite card. Uh, let's see. Go here. Elites. Okay. Now, Master Shen, if anything, should be to the right. If I can find Chao Tzu in the process, that'd be freaking awesome. But I believe Chao Tzu is a hero card. So I'll worry about him later. Uh, let's see. Master Shen. Master Shen. God, I have 285 hero cards? Holy crap. Oh, where would Master Shen even be? I, I should have also got um Vegito Blue on here too. But I mean that's that's something I could get like real quick because he's like all the way at the end, so it's not really too big of a deal. I just gotta find Master Shen. Oh, here he is. Okay, Master Shen. Crap, I, I don't remember. Oh no, Chao Tzu is a hero card, but I can set up uh Vegito Blue. Uh, can I reset this? Let's see. So I don't have to like scroll all the way over. Let's see. Hero. Or not hero. Um, elite. 
No, it, it keeps me here. Crap. Okay, so yeah, let me just scroll all the way to the side. Just real fast, try to get there so I can get Vegito Blue. All these cards, man. Look at the... Whoa! Oh, that's a powerful card. Oh, my. Okay, scroll all the way to the side. Okay, there's Vegito Blue. Okay, now Hero and get Chaozu. Our Chaozu should be on the right. He shouldn't be too far away. I mean, he's Chaozu, right, guys? Uh, uh, where are you? Like, he's a Z fighter. Like, and even at that, like, generally, that card is a weak card by, it, uh, card by itself. So, it shouldn't be, like, really deep in here. Unless he's, like, next to Tien or something. I mean, it also depends on, like, which um, game series he came from. Or, I guess, which mission, quote-unquote. But, uh, still, let's see. I don't think I passed him. And I have 293 of these freaking hero cards? Woo! Uh, I can't even find Supreme Kind of Time, but I'm pretty sure she's a Berserker, so... Uh, let's see. Oh, okay, here we go. So, there he is. And, just be safe, I'll scroll through... Oh, I... No, that's the wrong Supreme Kai of Time card. Okay. So, just scroll through real fast. See if I'm tripping. If I'm not... Okay, I'm tripping. Berserkers, I'm pretty sure, um, is Supreme Kai of Time. And then from there, we should have our team set. And that also helps me out a bit, knowing that it's going to show new on the card as well. Because since I've selected the card, I thought that it wouldn't show new anymore. But it does. Oh, wait, no, but that Supreme Kai of Time card isn't new. I've used it before. Have I? I don't know. Okay, let's see. Uh, where is she? Bruh, I can't find this woman. I'm seeing all these, like, fancy-looking cards, but I can't find hers for some reason. Like, again, in before, I'm just searching in the wrong section, man. That, that's going to piss me off. And if this takes too long, then I'm probably going to end up cutting it anyway. But uh, let's see. Nope, there she is. Okay, there we go. Found her. All right, I'm not sure how this is going to work in arcade mode. If it works, it'll be freaking awesome. But if not, yikes. All right, so we're going to use this one. Lower defense by 10%. It's better than nothing. Again, like, we don't have our excess or items equipped. So, this is probably going to be rocky at best. But if it works out, it works out. Like, we just beat one of the hardest missions in the game. My man, Frieza looking angry. Yeah, like, he doesn't even have enough health, but I know he has the freaking power. That's what scares me. Ooh, we don't even have the health now that I think about it. Holy crap. I forgot in arcade mode, it's... We end up having less health than we usually do in story mode, so that's not good. Let's see if I can set up my team properly, because right now it's all over the freaking place. Okay, child two right there. Zero blue up here. Hit up here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we are set up. Well, let me move these guys further away just to be safe. Okay. We are set up. Again, could you imagine if this worked well? Oh, man. Power. Okay, aim for him. Aim for him. This time. Already, Vegito Blue doesn't mess up either. Again, they lose all the key. He loses all the key. That's what I'm aiming for. I don't need you attacking me. I mean, let alone getting this match to, like, round two. I don't want that to happen. But we shouldn't be nearly as strong as we were in story mode. I know that much for certain. Hello. I butchered that. But there's no way you're going to have a perfect right off the freaking bat. Okay. 
I messed that up. Oh my. They even have I think uh Frieza nerfed us. Okay, miracle post. Really? Okay, thanks for taking that away from me. Thank you. I was like, you, you can't just take that away from me, man. Like. Uh. Uh. Yeah, seeing how much damage um hit dealt, he nerfed the crap out of us, so it doesn't even make a difference. Like, the team comp, I guess, isn't bad, it's just Frieza nerfed us. Like, that perfect would have been nice earlier. Crap, he beat me out. Crap, 3k damage. I, I couldn't even keep up. Like, his gauge and my gauge were going too fast. It was throwing me off. Yeah, I, I can't keep up. Like, his gauge and my gauge going that fast, it's, it's throwing me off. I, I can't. We lost so much health. And another... Oh, he nerfed us. Freaking nice. Something by 10% I didn't really see. Uh, let's see. Supreme Kai time, you're practically done, so... Put you actually all the way up here. Master Shen, you still need to stay there. Yeah, if we let Frieza get his any attack offered, well, I mean, it's kind of looking grim for us either way. He's going first. He has enough to do an ult. If we don't block everything... Yikes. And he got a perfect. The power of the death gun. Gone. My life. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Don't you gotta tell me twice. I will take it. Give me that health. My turn. <laughs> Can you imagine if I come back from this? That'd be freaking phenomenal. Uh, Miracle Perfect. I kind of would have appreciated that with, um, with Vegeta Blue. Because Supreme Kai of Time's doing nothing. Hit's doing nothing. The power of time. AWAY WITH YOU! Oh, wow. Oh, wait, no, that's collective damage. I'm tripping. Crap! And then he got a perfect. Okay. It's like, they know. They're like, we can't let Vegito Blue get his attack off. He has to keep the key. I, I couldn't. I, I didn't even have enough time to get back up there. Oh, that's a wrap. Yeah, and he keeps nerfing. I think he's nerfing our defense every turn. That's why he seems like he's getting stronger when he's really not. He's just killing our defense. Oh, well. Not giving up without a fight. Oh, yeah, he's, he's bodying us. Frieza, I'm sorry, okay? I, I apologize. Oh, yeah, I can't even block. <laughs> and he got a perfect. Wow. I need to add insult to injury. Freaking Lord. No. Oh. Gone. Straight Shadow Realm. Freaking yikes. I think I'm going to have to come up with a different strat for this team in Pits Art for this team. Uh, for this battle in particular, but. Even so, in story mode, anyway, that Chaozu team is freaking fire. Okay. Uh, I don't think I, uh, I don't think I need this. Yeah, final round for level one and level three. Yeah, no. No. Yeah, let's, let's just, uh, skip all that, you know, huh? <laughs> 
Skip. Oh, I still want to do the tournament, too. Because I think in the tournament, you do have your abilities. And if that's the... No, in the tournament, you definitely have your abilities. And if I can get that off... Oh, man. I know you can get some rare hero badges. I think that's what I'll aim for next. Because in the tournament, I really, really want to get some solid badges. But anyways, guys, I, I think that's a solid video. I mean, you guys finally saw me beat the Rage Trunks mission. We pulled some cards. We got bodied by Golden Frieza. I think that's nice and solid. And again, if you guys want a dedicated video, um, that's, I guess, me going more in-depth as to how you can build the team, then um, let me know in the comment section below because I would definitely be down to do it. But again, Ultimate Mission X, or just Dragon Ball Heroes in general, is a very niche series because, you know, it's exclusive only to Japan. I'm just fortunate enough to have, like, the proper 3DS in the game. But again, for those of you who do have the game, if you do want a tutorial on how to get it, let me know. I, like, I need a lot of feedback, all right? But anyways, I'm Inukuba. Like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.